okay, you know, I've basically created a blocker arm, I mean, a rocker arm, sketch, and, I mean, a block and an ellipse as a block, and I've fixed the center of the ellipse there and fixed this here, so basically, you know, these suckers rock, and I've established a tangent relationship between this ellipse and this rocker arm, so it allows you to do, you know, things such as this. Okay, now I'm in the process of drawing a cam right here. And remember, I'm not clicking the points. You know, I'm trying to establish tangent relationships between these lines. So instead of clicking, you know, on the nodes, I'm clicking off here so it'll establish. It'll make these lines tangent by default. Um, use a smart trim and get that going. <coughs> okay, now I'm going to turn this into a block. Okay, now I'm going to bring another um, call this cam. Whoop. Shift. Fix it out. Okay, anyway, I want to insert another um, rocker arm into the assembly. I'll put it there and I'll fix this in free space so that it's rockerable. Now, thing is, you know, is I can't really just select like this and this and put a tangent relationship on it, and the reason is is because it'll start to do squirrely flips. Anchor that too. Um, it'll start to do squirrely things, you know, once you get off, <laughs> you know, that line, you know, those two mating lines. So you got to convert this to a path entity. Okay, so, you know, if you go um, click on the block, so we're in edit block mode, um, you know, if you go up here, oh, oh shit, God, I hate this thing, now oh, make path right there, okay, and you select what you want to make Okay, I had to go edit it. It did create some kind of path, but I had to go edit it now. Um, you know, so anyway, now that's a make path. Um, you know, it's made it in a path. You know, it should work unless... No, it doesn't. God damn it. Okay, fuck it. Okay, thanks to the goddamn bugs in this program, I basically had to delete everything, stop out of the damn sketch, and start it again, uh, and then replace everything because of the goddamn fucking bugs. I mean, I deleted these things and the relationships, you know, they're still there. You couldn't get them to disappear. <clears throat> but at any rate, I reinserted this fucking thing, you know, and then, you know, selected them to apply a tangent relationship between the two parts. I'll do it again and see if I can get it to work right. Show you what I did. Um, insert block, cam, <coughs> right there, rocker arm, right there, and I'll have you note that the, you know, the keyboard shortcuts don't fucking work. I got to do something about that. You know, put a cancel button on it or something. Okay, anchor point, anchor point. All right. So now I've got this able to move and this able to move around that, but then I got to go try to select, con control select both of these two, and then I can put a tangent relationship on it, and then voila, it works. Now I'm drawing this. I drew this thing, you know. I went and edited the block and drew this part of it, so you know, and hit save, and this little thing here, 
now I'm drawing off to the side of it. You know, by activating the deal before I start to draw. <coughs> so it'll make it in parallel with it. So. <laughs> now, I'm not really doing this. I mean, you know. Um, Okay, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and make this a block, and I'll get back to you. Okay, I went and <coughs> drew a line here, and I fixed the endpoints, um, and I went and drew a construction line on our block, but I made this line a block, too. It's very important when you're dealing with these kind of things to make them all blocks, so, because you get new options open to you, you don't get with just plain old sketches. But at any rate, I'm going to... I'm going to make these collinear. You got to be careful to select one, not the other. Um, okay, the goddamn thing <coughs> was uh, overdefined. Apparently, it had some kind of parallel relationship, so I had to delete that before this stupid thing would take. And that had a parallel relationship because of how I drew the line, you know, so it was implied. Anyway. Um, Okay, I went and edited this plunger valve sketch, you know, so we had an arc on the end of it so I could actually click this and this and put a tangent relationship on it. So, um, now when I move one, you can see that the plunger, you know, pretty much follows the action of the cam. And I'll go edit this sucker since, you know, these really aren't. I'm going to make that a little wider. Um, oh, good. And that has the uh, benefit of fucking my sketch up. Okay, so i got to go fucking, you know, redo the goddamn thing again to reestablish the fucking relationship. Yeah, so the Duke key didn't work worth a shit. <coughs> 